A family business is founded and owned by a family. Usually the family continues to be a stakeholder, and then sometimes in its evolution it will bring in professional management, sometimes it, it doesn't. There's a crop of students who are either going into family businesses, are going into private equity, are going into wealth management, are going to become consultants to family enterprises since it is the dominant business form in the world. And all of those people need to know more about who they're working with, who they're working for, and how it's going to impact their lives. What type of a family do you want to be? The family is more important in a way to the business. Our program has three pillars to it. One is research, one is curriculum, and one is community. We are one of the very few places where our own faculty is actively working of research of the highest caliber on family firms. The professors have many years of experience. They also have a wide network of connections. I've taken two classes so far and they brought in amazing speakers in every class. This program I think does a really good job at helping people differentiate how do you take back what you've learned here and apply it in your family. The family business program offers you the opportunity to be part of this great community formed with students, practitioners and academics. What I, I learned in class was really uh, practical to my life. Uh, my family was discussing at the same time this governance, succession, conflicts. When I was in Colombia, one of the key aspects that I took from, especially the family business, business program, was the um, aspects from case studies that we learned throughout the week. Seeing how they do it and how we can implement that in our own organization. If you are a student today and you're serious about family enterprise, we are serious about it. We're looking at management, we're looking at ownership, and we're looking at family from multiple angles. The students today with a family business program have such a fantastic advantage. Transfer of shares, uh, best practices of non-family members being involved in the business, uh, ways for raising money for uh, the organizations, dealing with conflict resolution. We all have so much in common, even though we're from different countries with different languages and different backgrounds, it's still family. And we all know family's not easy. <laughs> and working with family can be even harder. It continues to evolve and we're very excited about the future. The fact that Columbia Business School is taking the lead in this, we think is really not only excellent, but crucial for many different applications. They'll come in with that knowledge, they won't have to struggle with why is that decision being made that way. I know now that I acquired a deeper knowledge of what experience I need to acquire before going back. If within 25 years of my passing away, the family breaks, then I don't look upon myself as being successful. If the family lasts greater than 100 years, I will be smiling. This is an area that combines heart and mind. And for too long, business schools have just looked at the mind. And I think we now understand that business schools need to focus on leadership and personal development. And family enterprise is the place where that is essential. No matter what role you're going to play, you have to be working on heart, mind, personal, and professional at all times. So it's a pretty exciting place to be.